The Shoreview City Council and the Economic Development Commission developed the Business Retention and Expansion Program, which we call the BRE program, as a result of the fact that we are almost a fully developed community. And we wanted to focus on our existing businesses and our key emerging and landmark businesses in the city. So for the past two years, Shoreview uh, Economic Development Commission, Council, staff, the mayor, have gone out and visited one-on-one -on -one with over two dozen businesses, uh, top businesses in our city. And through those visits, by being proactive, we were able to kind of put a face on City Hall, a first name basis, with our top executives in our number of businesses so that we could understand a little better what issues, what challenges they were facing, what kinds of things they needed help with. And it's interesting because um, a lot of times these businesses had never really had any kind of personal contact other than permits, other than trying to get variances and things like that. They never had a chance for um, government to come to their door and say, how can we help you? Let us understand what challenges you're facing in this new economy. I think that uh, PAR Systems and TSI are great examples of uh, two local companies doing business all over the world, two very high-tech global companies that both, even in this unique uh, economy, had opportunities for growth and expansion. And through our relationships that we've been developing over the last two years, we were able to uh, be flexible and collaborate with them in a way that uh, facilitated their growth and their expansion quite easily. So in addition to the very significant private investment that both companies have brought and benefited our tax base, what's really important here is the number of jobs that, that they will also bring. And we're ex anticipating, or they're anticipating, several hundred highly skilled, high-tech jobs that will benefit Shoreview and the region. I really, uh, Sandy and Tom Simonson, really want to thank you and express appreciation for, from uh, PAR Systems, myself, and all our 500, uh, almost 500 employees. You know, we've been in Shoreview since 1961, and uh, the competence and the professionalism of the city management uh, that you two lead uh, is just tremendous, and it's really the reason we're still here and able to grow. I call it lean leadership. Uh, lean leadership at PAR simply means uh, getting things done efficiently and as quickly as possible and doing them right. Uh, the city definitely does that. Uh, in our business, which is intelligent solutions for the nuclear industry, uh, for the aerospace industry, for marine industry and life science and others, we need to be lean about how we solve complex problems for our customers. We do that. You have done that for us several times. We have had a need uh, to quickly find new facilities and accommodate the growth of our uh, business. And you have helped us do that. Uh, I think uh, the city of Shoreview that you lead uh, is at the pinnacle of and looks like uh, the best of government. So we thank you for that. Uh, Brian, I think you can talk about some specifics of uh, well, why this has made a difference. Over, over the 52, 53 years of the, of the company, there's been several occasions where the business has had to expand or respond to the needs of our, our customers, uh, particularly from the standpoint of new facilities and very specialized facilities, which were a bit extraordinary for any community to accept. Uh, the city of Shoreview has been very responsive to that. Uh, in our old location, which was in Shoreview, and now in our new location, which is, thanks to the city of Shoreview, is developing into a campus of, of three buildings. Um, with they're working with us for the, the county, uh, Ramsey County, to acquire the sheriff's building. All that had to happen at a very fast rate, given the quick turnaround requirements of our customers uh, in our project-based business. The city of Shoreview gets that, uh, and over and over again, they've been responsive to us, and we've been delighted to be a partner with them, and we hope it continues for a long time. 